clan before. They were a kingdom of farmers and merchants. Even farmers and merchants can fight when led by the right person. I hope your faith in pig farmers is not misbehaved. I hope your faith in pig farmers is not misplaced. There is work to do, yes. We will rise to meet you in the
how to kill any strangers. That'll do nicely. Find something? There's a crate of hack silver here. More than enough to make everyone happy. We'll take it to the ship. A hard one fight. The first of many, Oswald. Have you the will to keep it up? This is my gift to the brothers. I have more than enough wealth in Elmham to widen their eyes, but this will be a symbol of my commitment to our fight. It's a good start. Take what riches you find to Norwich, then send for the brothers. I'll meet you there. Livestock and a trophy from our slain enemy. What more do you want? No battle then to Dane would ever follow this lump of lords into battle. I don't care how many shields he brings me. You mean to say you refuse my gifts, Broder? I don't have time for this. It's a generous offering, brother. You'd be a fool to turn your back. Refuse this, and your shame will stain the name of your sons and their sons beyond. Stay out of this, wolf kissed. Take the gift. We have bigger problems. One of Ruid's men. Aye. Sniffing around the outer walls. 
Looking for an easy way to slip a few dozen men inside. If there's one scout, there will be more. Something you might have learned if you kept him alive. I was passing water when he surprised me. It was either him or my plow sword. Where did you find this one? Just outside the Northwich Walls, by the water's edge. They will be looking for points of entry to sneak a herd of raiders through. Jesus. Find another scout. We'll question him. I'll look around. The rest of you stay here and out of sight. If I find anyone suspicious, I'll bring him here. Ruid scouts would be camped near their boats outside the city walls. One of them will talk. See you, old friend. Looks like one of Bruid's men. Spread your wings, Sunan. What? Wait, wait! What are you doing? I'm just a pig farmer. You are awfully well armed for a what? Stay down, Muckworm. I have some friends who'd like to speak with you. I tell you, I'm a cow farmer. Let me go, Dane. You said you were a pig farmer just moments ago. It, uh, it's not beyond reason. I fed for many livestock. You are as Dane as I am. Save your breath, liar. send you to speak now and you may live to see tomorrow Arger swine that won't make you any friends here a scolding like that is a mortal offense boy I killed the bastard don't give him time to act again I'll ask once more why were you lurking around Norwich's walls I came to pay my respects, Lord, to Oswald, the whimpering Saxon ergy of East Anglia. Tell him why you're here, and you may walk free with your head on your neck. Lick 
My dunghole. Here's the term I use for licking. How does it feel against your ass? When the braziers lit at Dunwich, Ruid and his men will rally. They mean to attack Northwich by its weakest wall. <laughs> you English Danes are soft as butter now. Ruid sends his blessing, lady. He'll see you again very soon. You've served your purpose. Time to die. You promised he'd go free. He insulted you before everyone gathered here. Don't ever let that go unanswered. I will not have blood spilt needlessly in my kingdom. This has to end. Alive, this man was a risk. Valdis. This man spoke as if he knew you. Ruid was my husband. Your husband? You're married already. I was. We've been apart for five summers. I never expected to see him here. And I never wanted to. East Anglia's prosperity depends on our safety and unity. With Ruid's clan stomping around, neither is possible. I must speak with him myself, man to man. There's no place for him in East Anglia. He must hear it from me. Right. I'll start looking for a new king tomorrow. It was good to know you, Lord. Ruid will eat your lungs for supper, Oswald. Steer clear of him. If I'm to be a worthy king, I must meet the man who bedevils us. I'll light the brazier at Donich and face him when he comes. You sure you want to do this? Meeting Ruid in the open comes with many risks. It's the only way. We must face him head on, and we cannot waver. Come, Oswald. We make for Dunwich. And of course I will see the lot of you there as well. Else the songs of your cowardice will ring out over the generations. I'm sure you're heading to Dunwich any moment. We'll be there, Eivor. You don't speak for us, steward. Need I remind you, Wags, what Halfdown will do with us if East Anglia falls into Ruid's hands?
Gato means
its men tore through it. Eivor, you made it. Dunwich. It is time to light the brazier. I'll light it. You do the talking. Ruther, Valdis, and I will scout the dock. Make sure there are no surprises. Oswald and I will hold here until the brazier is lit. The front gate is heavily guarded. You'll not be walking in. I'll find my own way. We'll be watching you back. Stronger already. Dunwich. Now to clear out Ruid's men and light that brazier.
the kill. Of them. Once the brazier is lit, the rest of Ruid's men should arrive. Odin gives me a bargain. A few dead men at my feet in exchange for a ripe East Anglia, and my wife returned. What a day! You. I don't know you. You don't need to know my name. You won't have a use for it beyond today. <laughs> Who called for me? Was it you, Valdis, my love? Why would I call you now, after five happy years away from your stinking balls? I called you, Ruid. You, Oswald, the hopeful king of East Anglia. And Valdis's husband-to-be. Take your men and go. East Anglia is strong with Saxons and Danes united. It will not fall to raiders. Must I set sail for Denmark with nothing to show for the journey, after coming all this way? You'll have my weight in silver. And an abundance of livestock and grain. I've taken ten times that already. What's the real prize? I'll make you an offer, Pigfoot. A home gang, just you and me, for the future of your kingdom. I accept. I accept. A fight to the death. East Anglia's the prize. Let it be heard. The hazel is laid! The square is made. When you see a chance, lead Valdis and the brothers to safety. They must not fight today. East Anglia needs them. 
Let me be your champion. No. He called on me. Whenever you're ready, King of <laughs> Sheep <laughs> I'm ready! They're breaking off. They've given up for now. That puts some distance between us. We can rest a moment. By Thor, he fought well. Raging like a bonfire. We should go back!
Oswald may have survived. Ruid as well. It's possible. Ruid's men will press their advantage. We must be ready when they attack. We'll go to Norwich. Meet me there where you can. He died a hero. There's no doubt. If his god won't take him, all the sword women will. Another king lost Abel. Stop washing your face with mead. How can I face half Don Yarl now? I fail him again. We can take the battle to what remains of Ruid's clan before they hit back. Easier said than done. His men are holed up in Borg Castle, a fortress on the sea. On the sea? Then it must have a harbor. It does. Guarded by a gate of hefty iron held in place by timber spikes, difficult to force open. Timber burns. It does. But how do we reach it? We rig your ship with oil at her front and sail it ablaze at the gate. They would see us coming long before we reached the walls. We raise a feared, an army of East Anglia's farmers. Throw them at the front gate as a distraction. Saxons willing to die for a bunch of Danes? It's a stretch. It can work, Finir. If they fight in Oswald's name, that is all the courage they will need. <laughs> you there! Did you hear of Thane Oswald's fate? Aye, we did. He dragged Ruid to the bowels of Elba, Dane devil. Ruid may be gone, but his clan still plagues East Anglia. And would you join us to rid your kingdom of his dogs? For Oswald? Aye, anything. Two eager Saxons is not yet defeated. But you may be right. We may have a chance. I can ride to Elmenham and muster what remains of Oswald's men there. But who else would join us? The Reeve of Thaithford, Winston. He's a bitter old barnacle, but he would fight to the death for this land. We can assemble a forward camp at the ruins north of Boer Castle. Ride with me, Fenir. Let's pay this Reeve a visit. With any hope, the Vault remains untouched by Ruid's violence. Hope is a scarce word in this kingdom. Maybe so, but I would rather hold on to something, anything, than ride with empty hands. Forget God, 
If Ruid's clan continues to roam this kingdom unchecked, the people of East Anglia will be as ravaged as these lands. And where we find ourselves? Riding into the... And where we find ourselves? Riding into the fence to beg a horde of frightened farmers for aid. To fight for a king that you gave them, Finir. Remember that. It was my task to find them a king, not protect that king against every danger that might befall him. Oswald wasn't crowned yet, nor was he married. I say you have some work yet to do. Right, right. No need to remind me how far I fell short. Watch your back. Ruid's clan may still be nearby. Sword and silver? We had a bit of fun. That's what matters. Its men are a blight on this land. Blight is too kind a word. A serious curse. Just ahead. Wood smoke and ash. Ruid's men have been here. is your enemy, not me. I come on behalf of the late Oswald of Elmenham. You're still a Dane from top to two, but you're meddling that led to Oswald's death, leaving our kingdom for the worse. Oswald died defending East Anglia, defending you. Will you not do the same? What? Die in defense of a lost cause? I have problems of my own. East Anglia will fall if Ruid's clan is not defeated. Fight with me to drive them off, for Oswald and your kinsmen. Pretty words, Dane. But the men of Theovard have their own battles to fight. If you need an axe, I'm standing right here. There's a village to the east, Kingsbury. It was taken by Ruid's men a fortnight ago. I'll not rest until it's back in our hands. Let me and my raiders take the village. Save your strength and join us for the fight to come. Bold offer. If you do as you promise, the pikes at Theavard will be yours. I will take this news to our forward camp, Abel. Follow where you can. I will see you there. Kingsbury's church has a great horn atop its steeple. If you manage the task, blew it. I knew you kept your word. Oh, my God. 
Now. Some sort of armed camp there. Ah! <laughs> 
Give me a hand over here. Already dead. Reeve has come to join me. Let's hope his promise holds. The horn is 
been so long since I've heard that sweet sound! Christ me! Hail Dane! Over here! I held to my oath, Reeve. I hope you will honor yours. My promise holds, I. Theovord will join you in the fight against Ruid's clan. With your aid, we may yet save East Anglia. In past times, that horn was used to muster fears all across our land. You may find others who have warmed to its call. Good. Whatever willing men you find, rally them soon at the ruins north of Burt Castle. pick up from there.
Get back to the ship. Baldis must have got to them. The brothers' fleet, gathered and ready. Stop that! Come on. We put my longship to use again. I was tired of it gathering dust. Our ships are sturdy, but Berg's walls are sturdier. But this plan of Finners is mad. of your actions in Theovord has spread. Men are pouring in from across East Anglia, and our ships stand ready. The Edward's Reeve is with us. Its men will be here soon. More than his. The Kingsbury Horn has inspired men all across this kingdom. We will have the army we need. It seems Oswald got what he wanted in the end. Saxon and Dane united in common cause. A pity he is not here to see it. Forces will be ready soon. Are you ready to start the assault? I am. Our target is Burg Castle, said to be impenetrable. Good. Let them have their false confidence. 
By cover of night, Baldus will lead the field at the front gates. With Ruid's men distracted, our forces move on the sea gate from the backwaters at their backs. And once we're in, we'll leave no gate closed in that castle. Ruid's men cannot be allowed to dig in further. Your longship, is she ready? She awaits her own special glory. They need your words, Abel. Oswald was a man who didn't hesitate when you sought him for favors. A man who was fair and strong. A man who gave his life for his kingdom. Honor him today. Honor his memory, and fight with the same extra courage he showed! For Oswald! For Oswald! For Oswald! Now is the time. Today we rid East Anglia of Ruud's clan, once and for all. Remember the dream I spoke of? You sailed through Helheim on a ship of fire. Here, it may come to pass. Dreams, life, maybe they are one and the same. Tonight I ride the flaming sea state, rushing to the spear den. A watcher alive and waters wake, another glory I will keep. Ready yourselves. Ruid shit stains will see us coming. Charge! Fuck! Oswald! Go! 
Put that glorious man to you! Ruin Fawn! Ruin Fawn! Prepare to cut them down! Kill you! Often take this soul! You die now! Fight smart!
Fighting over a filthy Saxon horse, son. If this swine is your prize, come and uh. get him. Spoken word. Give yourself over. Taken prisoner to a Saxon? To you? Never! <laughs> the Saxon lover comes to fight. A miserable clan you lead, Ruid. Yes, and one that has bled this country dry for two summers! You are finished here, Ruid! Your battle is not yet won, Oswald. Uh, flee, Ruid! While pity restrains my blade, not till I've taken all these shores have to offer. Yeah! <laughs> 
Anglia will have its king, and it will not be you. That groveling worm in a cage. You must be blind to stand with such a man. Dane, fighting for a Saxon king. The Sagas will scorn this day. awaits you. Valhalla is my destiny. That fate will not be met today. Thank you. Throw in with these wastrels, these Argir swine? For what? A scrap of land and a promise of peace? Eivor, no! He should be tried before God, a lawful assembly. <laughs> <laughs> I won't have my reign begin with more blood spilt than is needed. Another screeching skull. This man must die for the damage he has wrought. The old laws are clear. These are Oswald's lands, to rule as king as he sees fit. Does Eivor bow to kings? To defy a king would shame him. East Anglia cannot heal without his honor intact. And what of your honor, Eivor? How much are you willing to lose? He deserves death, Oswald. That's our way. Eivor, please! <laughs> blood for blood leaves no warmth in the hearts of men, Eivor. None at all.
should speak with Oswald. See if he's well. Raise the old farm, Eivor. Saxon and Dane. We fought well, side by side. If there is to be a future for both our kind, people like you and me will have to change the most to live within it. Even if that makes us uneasy. When you are crowned king, the laws of this land will be yours to decide. All this is... is like a dream. But you are not asleep. Well fought! Well fought! The both of you! You came as well, old friend. If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. Our wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute. And I never... Oswald, stop. You fought with all your heart and soul. That's all you need ever do. Come then. We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. What some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Veneer? Are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is afire, but my body aches. I desire only a long nap. I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. For now I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. I should return to Elmenham. Oswald's wedding will soon begin.